and this is going to be um, some, something of bone meal, like how you make bone meal and how it grows trees. Now, bone meal is, um, it's not really initialized, but I guess it is, in the item die.java class. And here you can see, this is, this is talking about bone meal right here. So, we're in an on item use method in item die.java. And they're talking about using bone meal on different on different things. So an int gets uh, the block ID of what we're looking at, and then if that block is a if that block is a sapling, it, it calls the grow tree method of that. So it grows a tree. If it's a if it's a brown mushroom, you know it grows grows the brown mushroom. Whatever. Same with grass. Same with crops. Melon. Whatever. Okay. Whatever. Where what we're gonna do is you can't actually put your own custom tree into the bone meal because that would be modifying the original classes. What we're going to do is make our own bone meal and I didn't feel like making my own actual like bone meal item. So we're just going to use the catalyst, item blocking catalyst in as their bone meal. So if you open up item die.java you're going to want to copy this method right here, public boolean item use. So you're going to copy this this is pretty much where you're gonna get, and then in the in the body, you're gonna copy. If you go below this, below if item whatever, you're gonna start at int i int i l int i one equals world dot get block id get block id, and you're just gonna copy this part right here until it says return true and in closing brackets, you're gonna copy this. So int starts at int i one. And then it's going to end with the closing brackets. There's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten lines of code. Yeah, ten lines of code. You're going to copy that, and you're going to paste it right in the body of uh, of this method right here. Now, what also what I forgot to say, you need uh, opening and closing brackets on the body of that method. So yeah, and then in the body, you're going to paste in this code. Now we're going to start doing some replacing. So um, here we can see the int il it gets the block ID of which we're looking at. Next, um, we're gonna make this. In here it was uh, block dot sapling dot block ID. We're gonna make this our own sapling. So blockium sapling mod underscore blockium dot blockium sapling dot block ID. So this is gonna get replaced. Well, let me just put a comment thing right next to it. So it checks if if the block that we're looking at is a blockium sapling. Then it goes on to do this. So also we're gonna to need to change this because here it'll, it'll just say block sapling. So it was typecasted. This is this is called typecasting when it's okay. Whatever. I'm not gonna go into that. But uh, basically you just need to put your own class right here. Mine is block blockium sapling. So let me put some comments on this too. All right. And then you're gonna do again. You're gonna do your sapling. So mod underscore blockium not blockium sapling. No need for uh, that block ID this time, though. And then it's going to grow the tree. And here, um, this is item stack dot stack size minus minus. This decreases the stack size by one of the catalyst. But our maximum stack size is one, meaning our catalyst will be gone every time we use this as a bone meal. W what you can do is make a brand new item that has a stack size of 64. And pretty much acts like a bone meal. Get some crafting recipes to go with that, and you know, just make it as a bone meal. But uh, what I'm gonna do is make it a true catalyst. So let's co let's comment this thing out. So every time you use it, it will grow a tree, but it will not consume itself. So it's like a never-ending tree grower. Uh, this is kind of overpowered, but you know, I just wanted to do it. So yeah, that's that's that. Um, I am forgetting one thing. I just thought of something, and I forgot what I've. Completely forgot what I was talking. Oh yeah. Um, while we're here, while we're still in the coding, let's go down to our logs right here. And just to make this a true log, you're gonna need to add recipes. So let me let me grab a recipe. And you're gonna want to add recipes for charcoal and recipes for um, planks. So let's go ahead and do. Do item stack uh, block dot nope it's item dot planks planks is that 
No, no, what is it called? Uh, let's go into item.java. Plank. Nope, it's not called plank. What is it? Wood. No, it's not wood. What is it? Craft. Let's look in the crafting manager. Plank. Planks. Oh, it's block.planks. Okay. Why did I forget that it was a block? Why did I think it was an item? I'm so stupid. <laughs> Alright, so it's block.planks. So returns. Let's make this return four planks. And uh, if only one block here, um, log. So one log, it's gonna. Let me get rid of this. So what this says is pretty much. Whoops, let me get rid of this also. So if you put a blocking log inside of the crafting bench, if it's only one, you're gonna get four four planks out of that. So that's that's good, I guess. And now again, we're gonna need to grab a crafting and smelting recipes. We're gonna need to grab a smelting recipe. And I'm gonna go back up to logs. Um, we're gonna do class uh, class object dot block ID. So we're gonna do um, what are we smelting? Uh, oh yeah, so we're doing blockium logs log dot block ID equals, and it's gonna give us a new item stack. Um, no, it's item dot charcoal. What is it called? Okay, let's look at the crafting again. Coal. Um, torch wood. Block dot planks, block dot stick. Where is charcoal? I'm pretty sure it was charcoal. Let's I'm gonna file search it. Charcoal. Item item coal. Return item dot charcoal. Hmm. Why is it charcoal? Did I not spell it right or something? Charcoal. What the frick? Um. All right. Well, we're just gonna return coal then. Coal. That's really weird. I don't. So if you plank stick. Uh, ladder sign door. This is kind of bugging me now. Uh, what if I just put a log in there? Um, let's see, coal. Okay, whatever. I'm not gonna worry about that. So let's get out of this. Let's get out of coal. So it'll just give us a call, a coal if we cook it up, one coal if we cook it up, uh, cook up a log in the uh, furnace. So now it actually acts like a actual log. So um, I did tell you there was going to be one error that we're going to get, and that is going to be in the texture. So let's get out of the catalyst also because we already got everything in there. Item die, and let's keep this open. So let's look at this, and I'll show you the error right off the bat. I don't know how to fix it. It's probably something really, really easy. Uh, let me actually, oops, yeah, let me actually delete this. Yeah, it's something really, really easy, and you guys can probably figure it out. I'm just, I'm just missing it. Like I don't know. I just don't feel like looking at it anymore because the saplings were a lot tougher than I thought they would be. I thought you need to create an item that extends item block, and I th went through this whole like big procedure that was really unnecessary and. Uh, I'm just sick of the saplings right now, so I don't feel like figuring it out. But you guys can probably do it. So, the error of the texture being if you get saplings, they look like this. But once you plant the saplings on the ground, they look like this. They look like normal saplings. Now, I don't know why this happens. And so, let's test it out. Like, you know how we had it on sand? Trying to plant it on grass, it won't grow. So, that's good. Let me get a few more saplings. Oh, there's our cookie. Wow, that's a pretty common cookie. Shouldn't be that common. Alright, that was just a luck. Alright, so now that we have this, let's 
some more cookies. Wow, a three to three ratio. Oh, also what we're gonna need is um some logs because we need to make a blocking catalyst. I'll show you that that also works. So let's plant three trees. Now they do work. I just don't feel like waiting for them to grow because yeah, it just it just takes too long. So let me make see wooden planks that also works. Um, let me make some sticks. So you make a catalyst. So we are blocking catalyst. Bam tree. I used it and our catalyst was not used up. Bam used it. Bam and it works. Now if you, yeah, if you were just to wait on those saplings, it would have grown anyways. But for right now, um, I don't know how to fix that problem, but I do know how to permanently fix it, I mean temporarily fix it. So if you exit out of that and just give this, instead of a zero, just give it 15. If we go back, and yeah, you guys see what I did there, like right here where it says blocking sapling, instead of 2060, give it a 15. And this is the texture of, um, of the regular saplings, so when a sapling does drop, See, it looks like a normal sapling, but when you put it down, it looks like a blockium sapling. And also, when you pick it up, it has the blockium sapling name. So, you know, it's, I don't, I have no clue what's doing it. I try to figure it out. I just can't figure it out. So, if you guys figure it out, or if I'll figure it out, I'll probably leave, leave it on the, leave it on the forums. And, you know, so check over there if, if you want to know, maybe, what happened. But, um... Uh, yeah, those are trees and saplings. Next up, I think uh, I think I'm gonna do some kind of a wheat kind of thing, but I'm not sure yet. I really want to get into the GUI like furnace kind of stuff because that just seems like fun. So yeah, uh, make sure to like the video if you liked it. Put your comments down below. All your errors and suggestions will go to the forum, or they will not get answered. I keep saying this, and people still. Just send me errors on YouTube. Please don't do this. Put your errors and suggestions on the forums, on Minecraft forums. The the link is in the description below. You're gonna need it. Trust me. Um, there's also like other people solve your errors on there. It's pretty nice. And I'll get the errors more organized in a more organized ugh, organized way like that. So uh, yeah, that's my rant. I keep ranting about it every single time. But people still don't listen, so, yeah. Um, yeah, I mean, I got nothing else to say. So, hope you enjoy your new trees and saplings. And your new catalyst bone meal stuff. And, uh, yeah, thanks for watching. See ya.